here one night or two in only four trucks. Come on back, brother. Please subscribe, brother. Today I am going a little bit, as you guys may have heard in the, in the last video, picking up that conveyor there. Me and this guy are going to try to push it on with the lull. Hopefully get it loaded up nice and easy, get it tied down and roll on out of here. going to hang off the back a little bit, but we got a red flag for that, so no big deal. Yeah, I'm going to try to get this stuff set up and then see you guys in a bit. Alright, hopefully you guys can see all right. It's kind of dark. We are in Harleysville and we have a short ride to the turnpike and then it's just a blast uh, back home. It ain't too far. Just under an hour to get back to the yard. And I think on Monday I'll be delivering this conveyor to wherever it's going. It was uh, not the hardest thing, but it wasn't the easiest thing to get this loaded up either. It's kind of awkward and uh, you know, we were losing daylight and trying to get it done so it's not the straightest or the best placement on the trailer but it'll definitely work it's not that bad a little bit of overhang in the back i got some flags back there and such i was able to get a really cool picture in the sunrise go ahead and check that out it's neat things making noises already. I'm going to be keeping a close eye. I think there's like some salt or powder or something falling out of the hopper up there. You know, the noise, I just wasn't looking at the noises that it's making. It sounds like something's creaking or something. I don't know. I mean, it can't, it's not moving. A few chains on it, some straps. But I definitely don't like the way it sounds. And I can't just roll the windows up and pretend like it's not making noise. I'm not good at that either.
It's definitely not going anywhere. I just heard it drop some salt and stuff and then it flung it up on the tires. So that's beautiful. That's great. Hit the truck. No, I don't like it, but at least it assures me that the machine itself, the, the conveyor is not moving or making noise. This thing does sound great though, don't it? Woo! It's a beautiful thing. Man, this thing's frozen. Get with the program. I mean, I know where I'm going anyway, but... Yeah, like I, I, I was able to prop the phone up on the guy's truck when we put this on the trailer. And then after that, we had to move it, tilt it down, hook the gooseneck up. And then he had to pick it up from the side for me to hook up because it wasn't high enough. <clears throat> then he tried to move and it kind of fell and pushed it. It slid it all the way to one side of the trailer because the hitch got caught. It was like a nightmare, you know. As soon as, once we got up on the trailer trying to play with it, then it became a nightmare. So... I mean, I couldn't really film much for you guys because my hands were full, but... Overall, this is an easy deal. There wasn't like anything in it, you know, it's just like remnants that are laying out, you know, in certain spots. I brushed it off, but geez, there must be some in the cracks and crevices. better than to follow down the road than a smoky bear it beats him following me i'll tell you that It counted three, two, one, and then it just switched to somebody being able to walk. I thought it was gonna go a yellow light. But if I didn't turn the Jake on and prepare to slow down, it would have turned yellow then red super fast. That's how that goes. Yeah, that thing ain't, ain't moving for sure. I got it pretty tight.
missed that one. Come on, way high? Didn't think so. I just do. Oh, I was gonna say, like, what? be hunkered down in the right lane here for a while and uh, run this all the way back to our yard so not really a whole lot to see at this point I know this will kind of be a short video but um, yeah we get back to the yard maybe I'll tell you guys a little something something and then go from there well guys that's gonna wrap it up for this video um, I know it was a short one kind of but you know uh, is what it is but I definitely thought it was video worthy just in case anything super cool happened but uh, I dropped a little bit over yonder because I am not running it till Monday afternoon and I have some other work to do Monday morning. I don't know what yet, but um, yeah, so Monday's deal, it'll just be one video, won't be two separate ones, but the crane stuff was uh, kind of full video, so I broke this one into, you know, second part here, but uh, yeah, it was fun trucking. Um, that thing, I thought it was behind me, but that thing, uh, I'm glad it didn't move, it didn't go nowhere, even though it was a little awkward and a weird load, but Put a couple chains on some, it shouldn't go nowhere. But luckily, it's all safe and sound. All was good. Had a good time. Lights look great. I don't mind trucking at night. I kind of enjoy it. And it's only like 5 30, 6 o'clock. It's just super dark because it's winter time. But yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed this one. And if you haven't, please subscribe and see you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, brother. Over here.